to alert. Hello everyone. Happy Sunday out there too. Hope you've been enjoying this weekend. It's been really nice out there. But guess what? High pressure is going to be dominating our weather for the week ahead. Here's where that high pressure is and it's just going to stay right here. And high pressures circulate in a clockwise fashion. So it's bringing in much drier air and that's why we have very low rain chances for the entire week ahead. I've now put a 0% through Friday and then Saturday and Sunday, we'll see those rain chances bump up just a little bit, but I'm not expecting a whole lot of activity. Even though we won't be having very good rain chances, we're still going to keep our dew points at the muggy level. Now, this won't be the most humid week we've ever experienced, but it'll still be noticeable by many of us because, you know, we live in the desert. We're not used to humidity year round. So I wanted to share some humidity tips because how do you keep yourself safe with all this humidity? You, first, of course, whether it's hot, whether it's humid, no matter what, you have to drink lots of water. Make sure you are hydrating your body. It's also recommended to wear loose and light colored clothing to allow your body to sweat because it's certainly going to sweat with all that humidity. Take cool showers when you can and if you can just stay in rooms with air conditioning and just sit there all day long if you can. <laughs> all right, let's move forward. Here's a look at your evening tonight. Temperatures dropping down to the mid 70s and I do expect the winds will start to die down right around nine o'clock into the overnight hours. So if you're having any family gatherings tonight will be a little bit better and less windy than it has been today. And then tomorrow our temperatures for your breakfast time will be in the mid 60s. It'll be quite cool, quite pleasant out there. Labor Day looking quite nice for you. Your forecast highs across the region tomorrow. Look, we're looking at 90s in Las Cruces and El Paso. This is right around where we want to be this time of year. So not too hot, not too cold. 88 in El Gordo, 89 in Deming and 68 up in Cloud Crop. So if you want to head up to the mountains, that's where you'll get a break from the heat. Your Labor Day looks like this. Once again, highs in the low 90s, a really nice day to relax. That's what Labor Day is all about, to get rid of all that work that you've been doing and just enjoy yourself. So definitely I would recommend heading out to the pool because the weather will be quite perfect for that. Also, just a quick reminder, the photo contest results will be announced tonight at 10. So we got a lot of entries over 90. So good luck to all of you out there. Your 70 forecast sponsored by Mattress Room looks like this tomorrow. Labor Day looking really nice and our temperatures will stay right about the same for the week ahead.